Hello, I am Munir. I welcome you to my YouTube channel Munir Hussain Mathematics. Today our topic is very easy, square root. I will tell you how to find the square root and also I will tell you how to estimate square root of higher values without calculation. So first of all, we shall see what is the definition of square root. Square root of a number is a number whose square is that number. To understand this, we know that square root of 4 is 2 because square of 2 is 4. After that, we shall know what are the perfect squares or square numbers. Square of whole numbers are known as perfect squares or square numbers. For example, 9. 9 is a perfect square because it is a square of whole number 3. Similarly, 16, 25, these are called square numbers. So these are very important and especially the prime square numbers. As a teacher, we knew that what are the prime square numbers, but a student doesn't know. So that's why this is the problem for a student. So you should make up your mind to find the prime square numbers. For example, I shall give you some example prime numbers scares. For example, square of 2 is 4, square of 3 is 9, square of 5 is 25, square of 7 is 49, square of 11 is 121, square of 13 is 169, square of 17 is 289, square of 19 is 361, square of 23 is 529, square of 29 is 841, and square of 31 is 961 and so many like these. Now we shall start the question. Our first question is square root of 4356. First of all we shall divide 4356 by 2. So it is very easy division. We can write 2 to the 4. 2 ones are 2 1 left 5 carry 2 sevens are 14. 1 left 6 carry it will become 2 eights are 16. Now we have to divide 2178 by 2. This is the difficult division. So I shall take it separate and I shall also tell the reason why I have taken it as, as separate. 2178, when we divide 2, 1, the 2, 1 carry. 1 carry and 1 is not divisible by 2. So we have to take another carry as 7. And when we shall take 2 carries, we have to put 0 in the answer. So now it's 2, 8 is 16, 1 left, 8 carry, 2, 9 is 18. So it would become 1, 0, 8, 9. Now we shall try it on 3. 3, 3 is a 9, 3, 6 is 18, 3, 3 is a 9. 3, 1 is a 3, 3, 2 is a 6, 3, 1 is a 1. Now it comes 121, which is prime square numbers. It is the square of prime number 11. 11, 11 is a 121 and 11, 1 is a 11. Now we have 4, 3, 5, 6 is equal to square times 2, square times 3 and square times 11. So when, we'll, when we shall take square root of square number, the square and square root both disappears. So we have 2 cross 3 cross 11 and our answer is 66. We can check this by multiplying it again by 66. Our answer would be 4, 3, 5, 6. Now we shall go to the next question. 189225. In the end, at the unit, there is 5, so it is divisible by 5. First of all, we shall divide it by 5. 5, 3 is a 15, 3 left, 9 carry. It would become 39. 5, 7 is a 35. 4 left, 2 carry, 42. 5, 8 is a 40. 2 left, 2 carry, 22. 5, 4 is a 20. 2 left, 5 carry, 25. 5, 5 is a 25. Once again, the unit digit is 5, so it must be divisible by 5. And in square root, always a number is divisible by 2 times with a number. Now we shall divide it by 5. 5, 7 is 35. 2 left, 8 carry. 5, 5 is 25. 3 left, 4 carry. 34. 5, 6 is 30. 4 left, 5 carry. 5, 9 is 45. Now in the unit digit, there is 9, so it can't divide it by 5. So... If we want to divide it by 3, we can check it by adding the 4 digits. All the 4 digits. We have 7, 5, 6 and 9. If And if we add 
all the four the answer will be 7 plus 5 12 12 and 6 18 18 and 9 27 27 is divisible by 3 so it means the four digit number that sum is divisible by 3 it will also be divisible by 3 now we shall divide it by 3 3 twos are 6 1 left 5 carry 3 fives are 15 3 twos are 6 and 3 threes are 9 and once again it is divisible by 3 3 eights are 24 1 left 2 carry 3 fours are 12 and 3 ones are 3 now it has come 841 and i have already understood you the table of um, prime square numbers and 841 is a prime square number of 29 29 is a prime number and 29 cross 29 is equal to 841 so we shall do here 29 29 is 841 and 29 ones are 21 and now we can find the square root it would be 5 square cross 3 square cross 29 square root square and square root will be disappear and 5 cross 3 cross 29 435 is our answer so this is the uh, there are two questions of square root i have uh, selected two difficult questions you will get some easy question too but from these two difficult question you can easily understand the square root now the second part of the video is to find the square root by estimation here we have a question 8745 8745 and first of all we shall take the digits without unit and tens digit here 5 is the unit digit and 4 is the tenth digit so we have 87 now we shall check that that 87 is in between which two prime square numbers sorry only square numbers 87 is between two square numbers 81 and 100 so this is our first estimation that the number is in which two perfect square numbers so it is in between 81 and 100 so it means our answer will be square root of 81 cross 10 because these are four digits right so 90 plus is our answer which is now estimated so we have to now calculate the decimal point for that we shall take 8745 instead we shall take 87.45 minus the square of the least number in between 87 87 is in between 81 and 100 two square numbers so we shall take least one 81 87.45 minus 81 and similarly the difference of both in between 87 both square numbers 181 so both numerator and denominator we shall minus 81 the number which is the least number in which the given number unit and tens accept the number is in between it is 81 so we shall 87.45 minus 81 100 minus 81 87.45 easily minus 81 6.45 now we have 100 minus 81 which is 19 and we shall just easily divide without calculator 19 threes of 57 7 left 75 19 fours of 76 it is 75 so we shall take 0 0.34 because it is very near so 0 0.34 multiply by 10 we shall get 3.4 and we shall add 3.4 in the 81 square root 9 cross 10 90 90 plus 3.4 it is 93.4 so we have an estimated answer of our question is 93.4 hope you have understood this meet you in the next video thank you